Hello, welcome back to HWLRadio.com. You're here with your main man, Hollywood. And today, man, we're going to be getting real fucking spiritual. We're going to be getting real spiritual, y'all, today. Because I was just, you know, it was a Sabbath day. I was studying. And I came across that, you know, they call Baal, Babylon. Baal is, you know, an abbreviation for Babylon, which would be his city. So... I came across this shit on the internet, and it said that they was going to try to build the devil, because you know everything that God does, the devil replicates, and he wants to do the same thing, but better. That's why they say when well, you got that kind of spirit on you, it's a devil spirit. And why not? But this is the thing. They got the book of demonology, which basically breaks down, and shout out to Star, because that's who this is inspired by, Star from Star from the Morning, Star Report, however you want, whatever, which one you want to say, but my number one thing is, a lot of people don't believe in the Bible, because they ain't read the, the book of the devil, and the thing with the books of the devil is, it takes somebody that, it takes somebody that knows it take a person that knows God, God's laws and God's word because that's what it's going to take because the devil is cunning. And every time you, you get a word from the devil, you have to break down, is this of God or would this be against God? And that's the only way you know him because everything he says is whispering sweet nothings in your ear. And the number one thing that people don't realize is a lot of people say my intuition my intuition wouldn't lie to me. My intuition knows. Yeah, your intuition is part of witchcraft. That's the demons and angels talking to you. And a lot of people don't believe in the Bible, but this is another thing that I want to tell you. They got the Book of the Dead. They got horoscopes. They got all these things from the devil's book. And when you read it, you'll see horoscopes came from the devil's book. Motherfucking, it's like taking a bite of the fucking apple. Like, he lets you see, like, you can make money come, you can make this person fall in love with you, you can do all these things, but when you're doing them, you're selling your soul even more and more and more and more and more, and you're letting the devil step in and take control of you. But see, this is the number one thing. The devil, he always wanted to be better than God. So, if he takes more people off of the earth which he's trying to do, he's trying to destroy the one-third that God said he's going to come back and get. He wants in on that, too, so he could feel like he won. But this is the thing. God is more powerful than the devil. God made the devil. He made him the second strongest. So, you know, you think you... Everything you think you are is the, of the devil. Every little slick shit you think you is. Nigga, this is my playground. I'm about to use you. So... This world definitely needs to wake up because they done set it up in London. They said the United States is the best place. Then they say London is the best town to ever visit. And I was wondering why. I was like, why of all the places London? Now I know because it's the devil's, the devil's church is there. Like his doorway, his entrance, like the entrance into hell basically is in London. So y'all can take it as a grain of salt. Or, you know, you can look into it. But, like I said, shout out to Star, the Star Report. Because he had me, I was like, okay, I'm going to get into this studying now. Because I'm going to go a little deeper. There's other books that I want to read, but they say you'll die when you read the motherfuckers. And I know it ain't no joke. But I also know that faith in God is. That's why in the movies, they like, you got to have faith. You just believe. That shit's real. That's real life shit. All these Hollywood movies, they come from these books. All of them. Lord of the Rings. Did y'all even know that there was a ring that God made and gave? See, that's what I'm saying. But guess what? The devil had a ring. <laughs> Just say that. The devil got the ring. Now he turns everything, he flips it and turns everything evil instead of holy. But when you read that book, you'll see the majority of this world is leaning towards the devil. Like, you got to ask, would this be a God or would this be a devil? And there's your answer. And that's all I got to say about that. But that's going to be the show for today, so make sure you go over to hwlradio.com, download the radio station app, 
Make sure you check out the sponsors page and shit. I'm out. Niggas